We used to go to the reserve and cut trees down and bring them home 30, 40 feet long. You extend your sleigh to be able to get them in to, to take them home. And we'd take them home and we'd peel the bark off it in the spring. and let them dry. Yeah. And then you build your building out of logs. How long did you have to let them to dry? Oh, just over the summer. And then in the fall you In the fall you could build, or next year, whatever time you had to do it. And when you would organize it to build a building, like a, a barn or something, how did that work? Well, different times when you build a barn in the long days, you the same thing out of logs. There's no other way you have the, the power to build anything. If you bought lumber and that, well, you'd have to put the foundation down first, and then you put your foundation around, then you put your building up. But how many people would work on it at once? Oh, you can two, four, but six people, that's good. And how long would it take? Oh, three, four weeks. Okay. Depends, Depends how big it is and what you're putting on there. What time of year would you do that, in the fall? Summer, hopefully. Summer, summertime mostly. Because you want to put your cement down when it's good drying weather too. But I mean in the old days before when you when they would build a building, a log cement. building. Oh, there's no cement in there. Just stones. Find a flat stone, you know, flat stones are put on the underneath the log. Mm -hmm. Under the first log, maybe dig it down a bit to level it off and then start your building straight, you know, and cut your on the ends to, to fit your one into the other, you know, different ways, and that's all you... What kind of tools would you need an for axe. that? An axe, and then you make... What was that thing called? Draw a knife. Draw a knife, knife, yeah. Okay. And then we, like you, have yeah. A, you buy a auger for, do for making for holes in your... You cut yourself. Well, why <laughs> give you the damn thing to work with? <laughs> when to you hold play. your logs together, you got a... There is a drill you get with a handle on it, and you make holes in your, in your uh, Log. holes in Log. your logs. Maybe it. say three, four in a row, like say five feet apart or whatever your wall length is, you know. And then you put them, and then you make these wooden pegs, sharpen them down, and then put them in and hammer them down, and that's how you have the wall. Yeah. And then once you got so high, and then you the barn is, is buy really your bad shape. We're going two by four and two by sixes, and put your rafters. Yeah. Make your rafters and put your yeah. roof on. Yeah, nice. And the lumber, where would that lumber come? Well, you lumber either you buy it or you take to a sawmill logs and you sell them. Have your own lumber, whatever. You, <laughs> you you have a head, or not? You buy them if you can't. Yeah, them so. And the shingles? Shingles, the same thing, after you put shingles on it. And that's how you complete your building. Mm -hmm. And so, how would you be able to take off three or three weeks in the summer from farming? What Did both things. Oh, you, you, got, you got time to do it. You can farm. You can farm eight hours and, and six hours, seven hours, you could work. Because it was light because so Because nice weather, eh? And long days. Oh. You get up seven in the morning till eleven at night or ten at night. You get lots of time to do things. As long as you can.